Okay, so there's this application I want to get, right? I don't want to open it in Mac, uh, Mac Learning Tiger. Okay, um, you can download it to your desktop or documents or wherever you download to, or if it's already on your computer, just drag it to your desktop. I, I'm going to use Airport Disk Utility. Um, once that you download, you need to do the following steps with them, but the ones that are on the disk, you know, are right with it that are, you know, native Mac, like they came with your computer. Um, as a default, you can just skip the first step. Okay, drag it to your desktop. And now the first step to actually hacking it is, this is the part you can skip if it can with the computer, change the name of it. So I'm going to just, you know, highlight the name, change it to Safari with a capital S. Now, I'm going to right click on or if you don't have a uh, mighty mouse, you can hold down control and click. I'm going to go to right click show package contents. Now, you're going to have this uh, folder called contents. Okay. Now, you're going to have a file called info.plist. You want to open that up with text edit. Now, you want to click Apple, you know, the thing with the, uh, the key next to the space bar with the Apple on it, F for find. Now you want to type in com dot, and if this doesn't turn up any results, try org dot, I mean org dot, net dot, fr dot, until you find it, or you can find something that looks like this, it'll be like com dot apple dot, by, you know, something like that. Now, there are these, this line of thing. In this application, it's com.apple.airport.diskutility. It's between these two things, um, string and string, and they have those uh, greater than and less than alligator mouth things that a teacher used to call it. And you want to change this to com.app between the two, uh, Greater than, greater than and less than string, you know, symbols. Com dot apple dot safari. And make sure safari is a capital S. Now save, quit, close this window. Now you can open up this application. That's it. Um, if it doesn't work, try naming it iTunes and info.plist file uh, con.apple.itunes okay um, well that's my video bye